What is this? My brand new, ridiculously expensive Bonzino handbag, which you promised me if I canceled my date at the opera with Dominic, which I didn't. That's right. What is it doing on my desk? It's yours now. Okay. Just consider it a gift to congratulate you for still being alive. Why don't you just tell me that you're happy I'm okay instead of sharing me with your most prized possession? Would you just keep it, okay? I feel bad enough that Franco kidnapped you when he was really here for me. It wasn't your fault. Wow, you almost seem like you're happy he took you instead of me. No, you had your turn with the psycho. I don't mind stepping up. It's very noble of you. You didn't let him take pictures of you, did you? No, he just dropped me to a chair on top of a truckload of explosives. Did I mention that's a Bronzino bag? Yes, he did. Okay. Well, here you are. Spinelli, are you sure this is worth all the trouble? To overstrike these unsightly reminders of the darkly focused one's reign of terror is both necessary and proper. For the last six weeks, it's been all about Franco. I mean, he's been all anyone can focus on. It started with the art show and then escalated from there until he was the only thing anyone in this town could talk about. Well, I'm fed up with him being the center of everyone's attention. We need to stop gawking at that freak show and start taking a good look at ourselves. Inspiring soliloquy. You like it? Yeah, I just fear it's a novel means to a somewhat familiar end. It's another attempt to persuade me to be unfaithful as retribution for your trust with the darkly focused one. Not today. Today is all about a change of scenery.